Hello again. <laughs> it's me. It's it's me again in the same outfit with the same hat and the same jacket. <laughs> Hello, hi. So you already know when we sit here with the headphones. What time is it? Reaction time. I know my life can get crazy. Just remain solid and know that I got it. Choose around the globe. We can fly private, change the time zone, switching up climate. When the time cuts down in the trap, never mind. I hate no, can we pop? However, I'm rolling. I know that you're rocking. I picture you with Tina. Tell you go shop. She more the company. She a little cocky. I really think that's how she got me. All the way she is, you rocking with me. Okay, so listen here. First of all. I'm mad at y'all. Why y'all let me do the other two videos with no bliss sex? And if I post this one before the other two videos, then that's just what it is. But I, I'm mad because my lips dry. My hands already messed up. I ain't got my gloves on, but I want to have them on. But I done went to the urgent care a few minutes ago. So, Well, not a few minutes ago, but a couple hours ago. So I done got some medicine uh, to help with the eczema because y'all know I be having my Michael Jackson gloves on. But... <laughs> okay, so this one was sent to me by uh, Pastor Harris, a.k.a. Tamika, and she wanted me to react to this. Now, I'm going to play a small part of it, but YouTube be on some copywriting shit, and I ain't got time for it. So this is from Jack TV. So apparently he does, he's he's recreating cheaters, is, getting, is giving very much cheaters, where people call in to him and think they significant other cheating and shit and he goes and follow them and it's literally giving cheaters but i gotta respect the hustle though because i i know he probably make a bank off that shit so it's jack tv i just won't use a little clip because because fair use is a thing but i still feel like that with him with the copyright but it don't even matter fuck it we here so in this one because again i'm playing the little clip the girlfriend wanted to know if her baby daddy was she so she called i'm gonna call him jack i guess that's his real name i forgot i don't fucking remember but i'm assuming because his, his page is jack tv his name is jack so she called him to see if her, her baby daddy was cheating so now when i hit play she is about to go into her mom's house because she lives with her mama and i'm gonna leave that on that so we're gonna make sure we record hmm we're going to make sure we're doing that because that's important. All right, let's go. Maybe that old the creek ass though. You ain't going in there quiet. They supposed to be going in there quiet. Yeah, you know why they going in there quiet. Not the suspenseful music. Okay, that was that looks scripted as hell. Bitch, why the fuck did you look like that? What are y'all doing? Wait, wait, wait. Damn, she got Get off, get off, get off, get off. Let me talk to you. Let me talk to you. I don't want to talk to you. Let me explain it. Let me explain it. Explain it. We was coming. I ain't even talking to you right now. I ain't even talking to you right now. Why is the cameras here though? This is us. Let's go. You bring a video. Don't look like no fucking ass. Don't look like no fucking ass. Why is you in the video with my mama, bro? If you let me talk. Now, I did a video on the same situation, or not the same exact situation, because when Tamika first sent it to me, I said, oh, I did a video on that already. But that was the other baby daddy that was sleeping with the mama from like six months ago. I know y'all remember that shit, and if you don't, then uh, I'm not going to cue the motherfucking video is what I'm not going to do. But I may put the link in the description, but if you go to the traffic and chat uh, playlist, matter of fact, you need to be playing the playlist anyway. So, no, I'm not going to give you the link. Play the whole playlist until you find it. The title there. But <laughs> I had already reacted to something similar and said what the fuck I said. Bitch, let me tell you something. Me personally, I think I would have went for my mama. I think I would have went. First of all, the shit, that's nasty as hell. Gertrude, why do you have on these goddamn pajamas? I'm already mad at the pajamas. I'm mad at the pajamas because why you got that? If you gonna be in the bed with the nigga, at least have on a silk robe like the last lady. What the fuck is this? This is fucking ridiculous. Get 
Ew. This is my house. Y'all got to go. Let's go. Why is he the here? Get him out of here. Bro. You were in the place that you need to focus right here what because he you came hey, here. Don't touch the camera, bro. Bro, bro. Like, what are you doing? What are you doing? That's not her baby daddy. That's her boyfriend. I said baby daddy because I'm thinking about the old video. Let me get this straight. So you mean to tell me we've been together and this whole time you've been wanting my mom? That is some nasty shit. Nigga, if you wanted my motherfucking mama, why you didn't go for her in the first goddamn place? See, I don't have... I'm 30. My mama 52 years old. Now, do I want her dating somebody my age? Hell to the motherfucking no. But if she want to get down with the sugar mama shit... That's her prerogative, okay? That ain't got shit to do with me. But long as you don't come for my nigga. What mother does that? If that ain't some narcissistic, nasty ass, son of a bitch, need your ass whoops, plaid pajama having ass shit. That is nasty as hell. You should be ashamed of your motherfucking self. Bitch, you nasty motherfucker. Why don't you go find somebody your own goddamn age? If you want to play with the young people, if you want to play with the young boys, then go find you another one. Don't do not do it with my man. Don't steal it, my motherfucking boyfriend. And then he got the nerve to say, I... Baby, let me tell you. Okay, I got a problem with you. Gotta go. with my mama. This gotta go. This gotta go. But she don't, don't do care. anything for you. Okay, this gotta go. Leave, go to work. Either you do it with him. she got to fucking go. work. No, 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 because what the fuck, what the entire f***, you can't question me, I'm your I can't question you, you my mama, he old enough to be your son, what that tell you about you, get your hands off of me, bro, no, get off my face, get off my face, calm down, you following you for days listen i'm letting y'all guys know what's going on i've been following you for days man we was outside the whole time um because that's about it <laughs> that i can fucking record i don't want to take that man shit like that it's already risky enough but um baby let me tell you something she she hyped with it she she hyped with it she ain't with the shit but she ain't with the shit enough I'm a, baby, I'm going to need you to come in there guns blazing. I would have beat the brakes off my own mama. I, I'm, mad at the, I'm mad at the dude. I'm mad at my own boyfriend. But there's a certain level of loyalty that you have to have as my mama. Bitch, the level of disrespect you just gave me. And then got the nerve to say, get out of my house. <clears throat> And you always at work. You always doing this. You are so you trying to justify the shit, baby. I would have laid my mama out. I would have drug her around her own motherfucking house because that ain't that ain't Peter Panky. They ain't got security like that. So who the fuck gonna stop you? And if she got on the motherfucking play of pajamas, I can already tell she can't fight. I already know she ain't with the shit. I know she ain't with the shit. I can already tell you she ain't with the shit because my mama ain't never owned a pair of motherfucking pajamas. First of all, bitch, you fully clothed. If you was a real black mama, you wouldn't even have on no damn clothes. We don't walk around with clothes on. She, she like she got a bra on. What is wrong with you? You don't know the rules? Take your bra off at the door. Hell, half the time I go out, I ain't even got one on. Y'all lucky I got one on right now. I would have, baby, I would have came out that poncho or whatever the fuck she had on. I wouldn't even came out of that. I'd have just started swinging on her ass. And then after I whooped her ass, I would have had to swing on him too. Now, she was swinging on him because y'all know how I feel about domestic violence. She was swinging on him and pushed him. I don't agree with doing that shit, but in that very moment, I can't sit here and lie and tell y'all I wouldn't put my hands on that nigga. Because you are out of fucking line. But that you fucking with ain't shit niggas. 
you fucking with ancient niggas. You know if you fucking with an ancient nigga. It ain't no way in hell you didn't see the signs. That nigga fucking with your mama, your mama, and you live at your mama's house. It ain't no way you didn't see the signs. Like if he wanted to stay at home with your mama, or he wasn't even supposed to be over there again. In the, in the other video clip, I think the baby daddy actually lived there. But for some reason, and then he was over there supposed to be putting up the Christmas tree. Uh uh, what you help her put up the Christmas tree for? What you what you what what? <laughs> like what you? And then you lied and said you was with your homeboys. It's it's suspicious if your boyfriend want to be around your mama all the time. That shit ain't normal. It's suspicious if your mama want to be around your boyfriend all the time. You can't tell me you ain't see them signs, boo boo. No, Lord. You can't be that slow. But then a part of me feel like she is. I can tell by her ensemble. She looks soulful as hell. Oh, my God. She looks soulful, that poor thing. I know I be looking like shit, but it's one thing to look like shit and then look soulful. Yeah, and the mama looks awful too, so it must be hereditary. But it—it's <laughs> something fucking wrong with me, man. That shit's so goddamn nasty. That's all I can say is it's trifling and it's nasty. Like it's so disrespectful. It's—I hate disrespect. If I don't hate nothing, I hate disrespect, baby. She—I got to give her a fly. I got to give her her flowers and respect, cause I would have literally jumped across that room and beat my mama's ass i don't give a fuck if you brought me into this world i'm about to take you about this motherfucker because that's some trifling ass shit i'm finna beat you like a bitch on the street like you live legitimately like it's a stranger that cheated with my boyfriend that's how i'm finna whoop your ass and it's like normally you don't get mad at the woman because you get mad at the guy because that's who your loyalty lie with but that's your motherfucking mama that's your mama. That loyalty is higher than anything. Fuck him. He need his ass beat too. But no, my mama had to lay these things up on you. I'm going to have to put the paws on you because you legitimately got me fucked up. And then later in the video, she packs her daughter's shit into a fucking U-Haul and tell her she got to move out. So you done picked the nigga over your own child. Let me tell you something. You trifling motherfucker. It's some trifling ass mamas out here. It is some trifling ass mamas out here. Boy, Tamika sent me that shit. It was giving very much cheetahs. I didn't. It was. Eh, I didn't like it at first. I really. It took me a minute because I was like, uh, this really seemed like some cheetahs type shit. So I, I'm not really, like, give me something I can work with. And I don't like when people talk during the video and shit. Eh, I don't really fuck with all that. But when I seen what the fuck was about to pop off, I was like, okay, let me see how she gonna react. Let me see how this ends. Bitch, now how in the fuck you don't like when nobody talk in their videos and you talk in your videos? You hypocritical ass hoe. I can't believe I said this shit like I'm not talking right now. Girl, get the fuck. She didn't give me what I needed needed to be gave. Given. Gave. All that. It wasn't given. It wasn't enough violence. Baby, I'd have took that, that TV that was on the wall. I'd have took that bitch off. I'm fucking up everything in your house. Since this is your house, I'm finna fuck up everything in your house. I'm tearing all this shit up. That Christmas tree would have had to go the fuck down on my way out. Ain't no way. And and Jack ain't got no security either. And it got to a point where he started putting his hands on her. Like, after she was even, she wasn't even touching it. It was just kind of like, wait a minute, let me talk to you. Wait, but the way you doing it, though, you being aggressive and you putting your hands on me. So Jack had got with that nigga now. He put the camera down, so I don't know if he wanted to fight or not. I feel like he, he didn't. But he put his hands on it, sir. That's where you would have had me fucked up. I'm going to get the blammer. So y'all better go ahead and duck. I, I really truly believe I might be Medea in my other life. Because I would have came in there guns blazing. <laughs> like literally guns blazing. By guns I mean my hands. I would have went out blazing motherfucking glory. I'm setting this motherfucker off. 
You want to talk shit? You want to run your mouth? You want some gangsters front your motherfucking house? Because I'm going to set this bitch off. Period. Oh, mamas. <laughs> Man, let me get the fuck up out of here, y'all. I will see y'all in the next video. That's some trifling ass shit. Shout out to Tamika for sending me that shit. He got some other videos on here. I don't know. We'll see how this one go. If I if, if it go good, I might react to it some more. If, if not, then I might not. But keep on sending the footages, and I will decide if I want to react to them or not. Normally, most times, I will. So, especially if it comes from one of my patrons, because you know I love my patrons, huh? I love my, I, and do. So, I will see y'all in the next video. Until then, bye. Girl, you gave me your soul.